all right you guys this is just a quick little video showing you guys um how dusty the car can get over time i'll walk to the front because it's getting a little dirt and you can see with good contrast just how dusty and dirty the car is you can see some dark spots here and there looks like uh there's some water hit here and there so right now I haven't gotten my car washed, not once since it's been wrapped. And um, from the research I've done, it shows that you can just take a microfiber towel and wipe it like so. Um, of course, stuff like this by the, uh, the wheel well or whatever, it's gonna have to get got when you wash it unless you wanna ruin your uh, microfiber towel. But as far as dirty, dirty, dusty windows like this and stuff, you can, you can just knock some of that dirt off like this. And this is dirt that just settled from my car being where, where it's parked in my canopy. And me having my windows up. Me having my windows up for uh, the dust to get through. So I'm just showing you guys a quick little wipe down. It doesn't take too much time. It takes all of a, uh, depends on how how uh, crisp you want it. And no longer than about 10 minutes, man. You just wipe everything down real quick and I'll have you looking uh, a lot more shiny on the road rather than taking it out. Um, looking like a bucket when you have a nice wrap. You just give it a quick little wipe down. And shine. And then tomorrow, um, I think I'll start washing it on the weekend. Once a week, maybe. I'm gonna close this, uh, close my canopy down so you guys can, or so I can see how, uh, how efficient it'll work with just, it'll still get a little dirty here and there, but to see how much cleaner it stays without, uh, the windows being open to ventilate. Now that I have it bolted down to the ground everywhere, I can close those. So instead of letting the wind pass, Wiping my trunk, lining. See my clothes here, my construction gear. I'm actually about a. I just threw that in there for my my work car. I'm actually uh about to head to my local laundromat because I don't wash that stuff in my washing machine. <clears throat> so that's why you see my construction stuff. Just getting ready, ready for the work day tomorrow. I'm just taking this in. You know, beating beating some of that dust out, so I can get this other side. I wipe this nice and quick. All this uh, nice carbon fiber up here. See, look at how dusty this stuff can get. Look at. I should have showed you before. I just wiped that one part, but you can see how dusty that is. I want to just take a quick little wipe. You see how shiny and better, much better that looks. The window and everything. So. This is just uh, taking care of car wrap 101. Trying not to hit the corners too hard where uh, where the wrap is tucked into the corners because that can damage your wrap. Uh, so I'm not going too rough on this. Again, that's the reason why you get the microfiber towel instead of another, a different style. So you don't want to damage your scratch your, your wrap. You just want to lightly like we get all this dust off as I say it every now and then just give it a quick flip get some of that dust out of there I keep a couple of these in my in my trunk in case I'm ever somewhere and I want to freshen it up real quick and you can already see how much better this side looks and like I said it does need a wash so it's not gonna be spotless but Compared to the other side, you can see how much different it looks. So, again, this is just a little touch up. I, uh, I'm gonna work my way around the back right now. I did, uh, I did buy some stuff to spot clean it. Like I can just spray and wipe instead of uh, washing it with the hose. Look at that difference. All the way from over here to over here. Um, yeah, I bought some stuff. I'm gonna work my way around to the trunk right now. Let me show you guys. 
that I bought some stuff to spray and wash. Right here, you can get a little bit more detailed if you want and just hit the grill. And just go in between the teeth, not nothing too much, just where the dust settled. I'm just starting to hit it. Uh, this is a standing point for my, my car, the grill. So it was uh, customly done, so it looks more aggressive, so definitely want to hit that part a little more detailed. Hit the lights real quick, hit the bottom. Like I said, I'm staying away from the edges. Not, not gonna hit it too hard. I'm gonna peel any of the wrap back. I'm gonna come up here and hit this. I'm gonna do some wiping everything outward. I'm gonna wipe the dust back to the area I just dusted off. After you get a decent portion of it wiped off, then you can brush it off like so. Just dust it. Everything twice on this side. Right. Don't hit too hard. Um, down for my baby. Make sure she's being taken care of the proper way. Um, like I said, she will get a, a proper wash. Uh, chances are it's going to be tomorrow or Saturday if I'm not too tired after work. If you can, you can keep these separate so that you're not washing the car with a dirty one that got all the dust on it. For the most part, it's pretty good. You can see right here, a little bit of peel coming up from the, from the wrap. Um, me personally, I just take my finger and usually I'll curl it back around, but this, this is actually gonna get replaced with like a 30 day warranty, so. That's it.